An old grain mill is still burning after a massive fire in Grable this evening. At one point, the smoke and flames were so intense they could be seen for miles. News Channel 15, Sarah Wagner joins us live from Grable with the latest on the fire. Sarah. Good evening, Tara. We're here on Main Street and Grable, and as you can see, still a very, very active scene. This was the town's old grain mill, but firefighters tell me it was being used for lumber yard storage at the time. Very active flames still. The lieutenant I talked to just a few minutes ago said that this fire is nowhere near under control and will probably take a lot of time to fight. Now, there are at least seven to eight different departments working the scene here. They're doing several things to try and get these flames under control. They've taken out some of the lumber out of the structure. The lieutenant told me that that was really adding a lot of fuel to that fire and making it very difficult to fight. They've also torn down some of the walls of the building to try and get closer to those flames so they can have a more aggressive attack. Now, they also had to cut down power to part of the town because those power lines were so close to the building and they were worried that that would cause a lot of danger and a lot of damage to the town. Now, when firefighters got to the scene, they said they could see massive flames shooting from the building. And the fire started around 7, but firefighters don't expect to be leaving anytime soon. Uh, we will be here probably most of the night. The time we, um, there's so much stacked lumber and trying to get it tore apart so we can get in there to see what we got. It'll probably just keep on burning now. So that's what we're working on now. So I'm guessing it'll probably be most of the night throughout tomorrow probably. Now, firefighters have no idea what's caused the fire yet so far. Obviously, that investigation will take some time. The good news, though, there were no injuries reported tonight. Of course, we'll continue to have the very latest for you on Wayne.com. And, of course, on First News starting at 5 a.m., still a very, very active scene out here, and they think they will be out here for most of the night and into the morning. For now, we're live in Grable. Sarah Wagner, News Channel 15.